Hi, this is Pawan and I welcome you to my YouTube channel. In today's lesson, we're going to take a look at the chords and strumming pattern for the theme song from the film Yevada Raha, music by Adi Burman. It's a very interesting uh, set of chords, a uh, very interesting strumming pattern. So let's get on with the lesson. Now let's take a look at the chords that you need to know. If you're playing bar chords, you'll need to know mostly E minor, D major, C major, and G major. You will also need B major, E major, you could play that here or you could play it here and F major. Uh, if you're playing open chords, you'll be playing E minor over here, D major, C major, G major. That's pretty straightforward. And you'll also need F major. I'll be playing B major over here. If you're not able to play that, you could play this uh, with just the first four string. You could also replace that with a B7 and you'll need E major as well. Now let's take a look at the strumming pattern. I'll show you both in bar chords and open chords. Uh, there are two patterns that I've used, one which is in the Mukhra and one which is in the Antra. Uh, the one which is in the Mukhra is played something like this. I'll play it for you uh, in the original speed, then I'll slow it down and I'll try to explain to you step by step how you can play that. So here we go on E minor. I'll slow it down for you. If you're finding that difficult to play, uh, let me explain to you step by step. Uh, that's an eight stroke pattern. So let's first play eight strokes uh, without any muting effects, without skipping any stroke. And I'll call out stroke number one. So one, one, one. So those are eight strokes, four down and four up alternating. So now we're gonna put stress on one more stroke, which is the fourth stroke. So now you'll be placing stress on strokes one and four. Uh, of the eight stroke so one four so those are still eight strokes with the uh, stress being placed on one and four and now we're also going to add stress on stroke number seven so it'll sound something like this one four seven down up down and now all you need to do is add a muting effect to stroke number seven on which you're already placing stress. So it'll sound something like this. And now if you keep playing this repeatedly and start increasing the speed, you'll see it'll sound like the original pattern. So. The second pattern is the one which is used in the uh, antra, which is something like this. So those are the same eight strokes, except that instead of strokes one, four, and seven, we'll be placing uh, stress on strokes one, four, and six, and muting four and six as well. So I'll play it very slowly for you. First, I'll play those eight strokes uh, without any muting effects. I'll just play stress on strokes one, four, and six. And now we're going to mute strokes four and six as well. So it'll sound something like this. So as you saw, we are still playing the same eight strokes, except that we are changing where uh, we are adding the stress and where we are muting the strokes. And if you're using open chords, it's pretty much the same pattern. So for the mukla, it's something like this. So that's a. Uh, uh, placing stress on strokes one four and seven and then for the stanza or the uh, antra it'll sound lump something like this so that's placing stress on strokes one four and six so pretty much the same as uh, what i showed you for bar chords
Thank you for watching my lesson. As always, I look forward to your comments and questions. And see you again soon.